Hello, hello, hello. Time yes to roll. Welcome, 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 babies. If you are new here, welcome back. If you are returning, you know I missed you, love. So come on in. Get your shit, get your shit, get your shit. And get comfortable because we about to make a do what it do. The smoke detectors will beat, the planes will fly, I sing, I curse. If any of this is a problem, now is the time to click off. Please hit the like, the subscribe button, click the bell, all bell, so that you know it can be notified when I go live and when I post. If not, they're not going to notify you guys, okay? So we're going to jump into this divine connection read. Let's see what the message is for the divine connection at this time. Somebody's purging. This could be you. This could be a person. Somebody's releasing emotions. Letting go. Yeah. This is all happening in divine timing. Everything is, is playing out exactly how it was supposed to play out. Divine timing is at hand here. God is all up in the middle of this, okay? What else is going on for this divine connection? Yeah, somebody's releasing something here. They're purging, they're releasing. No longer holding on to something here. Like I said, this could be you. This could be your person. Yeah, this mask in reverse. Somebody is no longer wearing the mask. They're ready to drop their mask. So someone could be uh ready to, to let their emotions out, to purge their emotions. This is happening in divine timing. They're ready to release their mask, let it down, drop it. The answer is yes. So this person could have possibly been wondering um, how you felt about them or you've been asked wondering how this person felt about you. You could have asked a question about this person. The answer is yes here. I have material world at the bottom of the deck. This person could have been focused on more material things in the past instead of um, this connection. Yeah, oh, this person wasn't listening to the signs in the past. They were ignoring the signs and synchronicities. So divine had to step in. So this person could have known that they were supposed to purge. Whatever, release whatever it was they, they were supposed to release. They were getting this intuitive guidance and they were not following it. They were not listening. They were not doing what God told them to do. So God stepped in here and caused a tower moment here. They made them release it. This person had to drop their mask. They had to face themselves. Or they had to face something that they needed to release. Yeah, now they're ready to come in and put some action in. They're doing the work. They are releasing what no longer serves them. Yes, this person is going through a dark night of the soul. They are making changes here. You see, in the past they were stuck. And they were focused on money and material things. They were focused on hurt. Things in the, from their past. This person may return in the winter. Or something about the winter. Something could have happened last winter. Something about this winter could be significant coming up. Yeah, this person has some fear. Something happened in this past winter that caused them some type of fear. Could have been with you. Could have been with somebody else. But it caused them a lot of grief. Yeah, see, they weren't, they weren't listening to their intuition. They could have been listening to their family. So Divine, Divine had to step in here. And make somebody make these changes here. Now this person wants to come in and change the situation here with you. They want to make you their family. And you guys may not be talking at this time. There may be no communication. Yeah, but this person wants union. So they're releasing whatever needed to be released. So they, they can come in and make this change because they want a family with you. They want union with you. They're afraid that you may say no.
they are they are refocusing their energy at this time they may feel like you have refocused your energy on somebody else as well yeah they may feel like you're going to say no because you're focused on somebody else no longer focused on them while they're going through this dark night of the soul they want to come out they want to talk they don't want they want to come out of silence you in reverse they don't they don't want to be in silence any longer they want to come in and speak they don't want you to move on without them they don't want you to leave yeah whatever blockages there were i feel like divine stepped in yeah now they want to come communicate Whatever blockage there was that was causing you guys to to not be in communication, now they want to come in and put the action. They want to communicate. They see you as part of their soul tribe. And they, they want to ask for your forgiveness. So this person wants to reach out. They want to talk to you. They want to ask for your forgiveness. They want to beg for your forgiveness, for blocking this, for not listening to their intuition, for listening to their family. And not listening to God, not listening to what they were, was, you know, being guided to do here. Yeah, this person had to heal some type of inner childhood issues here. Yeah, this person doesn't want it to be over. They don't want it to be over. So they know they have to change if they don't want this connection to be over. So they're purging. They learned a lesson here. They learned some type of spiritual lesson. Could have been a karmic lesson. Yeah, they came to the crossroads and they had to make a choice. This person had to make a choice. They had to decide between whatever this blockage was and you collective. This this could have happened in summertime. Right? This could happen right now. We're in summer. We what? We got one more day. I think tomorrow or the 21st. Um starts fall. But now they want to surrender. They want to surrender. They learned a lesson. They don't want this to be over here. Yeah, now they want to come in and balance the scales. They want equal give and take with you. Could be dealing with a Libra. Yeah, this person is healing. They're healing so that they can come in and have forgiveness with you. I got spring at the bottom of the deck. They're hoping that you you don't block them. They're hoping that you receive them with open arms. Yeah, they know you know your self-worth. They now see their own self-worth here. Yeah, this person is ascending. They're going through a spiritual ascension at this time. Yep, and they're going to come back towards you. They want a fresh start. And they are praying you do not say no because now they want to be devoted to you. You guys are actually wearing each other. You want this person to... They're hoping that you have some type of understanding because they want this commitment with you. They 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 are no longer stuck. They did the tower. They went through a tower moment to release this stuck energy, this material world, this grief. Like I said, they may return in winter. Come out of this this this. They're afraid, but they're gonna come out the separation. This, this, they have big dreams. They see, yeah, this could be your twin flame. Spirit, collective, divine connections. Yeah, they want to come out of separation. They want to come out of separation. I do feel like this is going to happen in divine timing. But yeah, they're ready to come out. Yeah, they're doing the shadow work because they want to come out of separation. They want to be devoted to you, and they no longer want to settle. They could have been numbing in the past. Yeah, winter popped out. So winter could be significant here. And yeah, this person's not happy right now. They're not happy without you. They're trying to release this fear. Yeah, they're going through they're going through these tower moments. They're right smack dab in the middle of this shit right now, babies. Yeah, they're dealing with a third party. 
no longer wanting to settle. They're, 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 they are, yeah, they blowing some shit up right now. Yeah, because they were unawakened. See, they dealt with this karmic because they were unawakened. And now they have to go through this karma. Yeah, they realize you're their soulmate. Spirit is asking that you be patient. They're asking that you be patient. They're coming back towards you. They see you as part of their soul tribe. Yeah, they're releasing this pride and ego. They do visit you in, in the spirit realm. Yeah, they, they could be coming back in, 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 yeah, in fall. You're going to come out this pause in fall. Fall is tomorrow or the 21st or something like that. So it could be as early as the 21st. They're hoping that you don't say no. Okay, because this person realizes that they're in love with you. Yeah, they're closing out karmic cycles. Yeah, with a karmic partner. So they can come towards you. They're healing their inner childhood wounds. They're in contemplation on how to get back here with you. They're in a lot of regret because they want this commitment with you. They should have never abandoned it or abandoned you. Now they're coming in to surrender. This could happen in summer. We still got a couple more days of summer. So this could happen any day now, right? And this is a twin. They've been sitting back watching you. Whatever they were bound to, they could be obsessing over you. They're releasing that. They, they, they recognize who you are. They feel bad. And they're hoping that you receive them with free will when they come back towards you. They were at a crossroads. And now they took the time to reinvent themselves. And they're getting some understanding. They're raising their vibrations. They know they have to come and be honest with you about the deception. Because they now realize that you guys are marrying each other. And they know they have to compromise. But they see you guys having big dreams. And they know you're the divine counterpart. Divine fit into the divine master. You can't make it. Now they see your self-worth. And they know their self-worth. They're thinking about reminiscing, okay? They're being guided back towards you. They're no longer stuck in this material-ass world shit. They're no longer stuck in fear. They're no longer numbing. They're finna spring into action, okay? They're awakening. They're in solitude right now, but they're headed back towards you in a new direction. They're releasing this victim mode so they can come towards you and make an offer. Okay, babies? 12-12 on the clock. If it resonated with you, let me know. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, and share. Until next time, my loves, you keep rocking with me. I'm going to keep rocking with you. Love, light, and peace. Bye, my TT babies.